Hello everybody, and welcome back to the iRavens YouTube channel. It's me, iRavens, and welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a clan raid with my team. Or my raid team, I should say. So I'm going to be doing three raids with my friends. Since the raids last, you can do raids for an hour. I'm only going to record three, and I'm going to stop. So I'm going to ready us up now. We're going to go into the first one. We're going to win this. So I'm going to be showing you guys what exactly to do. This is also Pixel Gun 3D number 12, part of my series. And yes, yeah, so let's get into this. So when I start the raid, the first thing to do is send a scout up front to go look for turrets, which I think I'm going to do that this time. So I'm going to just jump up here. I'm going to look for turrets. I'm going to hold my thing out. So you guys see, they have a lot of turrets up there. So now my squad should know that the turrets are up there. And they should know that we need to be careful going up ahead. Also, if there's no turrets up in this front area, they're probably going to have guards to take that care of that for you. So yeah, you got to get rid of the guards first off, but they do respawn. So if they come back for you again, don't think it's hacks. They do respawn. Also, we do have the um, best cannon. You can get the highest tier cannon. So raids are not that hard for us. Also, we do have the medical station, and also we have special healers, because you do not get revived in clan raids if you're down or if you die completely, you're out, basically. So, like, I just fell, and if I would have died completely there, I would have been out. So, what me and um my friend Diamond Fox do, who has a YouTube channel, I'll put the link of Diamond Fox in the description, what we do is we go for the um, missile stations because everyone has a missile station. Let's be honest there. It's almost dead. Once this is dead, I can leave this. Because someone has to go get... Um, somebody has to get DNA. So we killed that. So now it's a straight shot to the end from here. So let's get in the ram. Let's get this going. So remember, I'm only going to do three of these. This is only the first one. This video might be a bit longer than usual. Yes, yeah, so I'm showing you the strategy to beat these. So only destroy the turrets that are bothering you the most. You don't need to destroy them all. Something you have to learn. And yeah, once you have that down, you should be good. I'm distracting the cryo freezer so that they can go forward with it. Because once we're far enough forward, it can hit me there. I just got to get forward is all you have to do. So we just go forward from there. And here we are. Up here now. So now we're just as a straight shot from here. The guided missile station might be a bit hard to get. So I'm going to distract it by getting it shooting on me. So my team can go forward. And yeah, I'm sorry I haven't been uploading the last couple of days. I've just been thinking of video ideas. And I thought of this. And yeah, also tell me what I should do in my next video. And also, I hope you guys enjoy my thumbnails. I know they're not the best. And I know they're... I know they're not that good. But that's the best I can do at the moment. And oh no. I think we might be done here. Oh no. Okay. Um, DNA. You gotta help me. DNA. Oh, dang it, guys. We died. That doesn't usually happen. Well, that's sad. Well, I guess um the next row you might be able to do better, but I'm going to put spectator move on so I can see what's happening. Because these two are still alive. Because I think um, Ash dude died as well. So I'm going to keep spectator mode on both of them so you guys can see what's happening. And yeah, so with the clan raids, the first one's always the hardest because I didn't scout their fort because I immediately started recording, the recording this. So I didn't have a chance to scout their fort out. So I didn't know what was coming up, so... Always scout the fort out. Always. Never always do it. If you don't, it's not going to end well for you. And as you can see here, Diamond Fox has the right idea. DNA is just taking out turrets, which you don't need to take out those turrets. Just go straight for the gate once you're there, like Diamond Fox is doing. So it's like the don't and the do. So yeah, after this one, we're going to go into another one. So I'm just going to wait for this one to finish up so we can see what the results are for the first one. And then, yeah, we'll do a second one. And if it goes well, I'll do a third one. If it doesn't, 
Then I'll just stick it, end it there. So Diamond Fox is gonna have to heal DNA here. Okay, so they're healed, so we just gotta hope they get this gate down. Let's hope they capture the thing. Which I hope they do, because we need these points really badly. This is probably the worst season we've done so far. Because we it's kind of like an off season. Because you know everyone's back to school. We're planning on going on a trip soon, so you know. It really is a bad time for a clan war. So don't blame us if we made we might go down a league. I hope we don't. But yeah, that should be a victory right there, because the flag's up. So that should be a victory for them. Yep, we did it. The first round we won. But I died, sadly. <laughs> and so did my friend Ash, dude. So I'm going to go and invite everybody once again. And if this one goes well and I don't die, I'll keep this video going. Because I've got a couple of things i got to do today. So I'm not going to... If I don't record the rest of this week, I'm sorry. I might do a travel time lapse because we're going to be driving for our trip. And yeah, so... We're going to be in there one second. Okay, so we're going to go in. Let's hope the connection glitch doesn't happen. It didn't, so we're good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stay behind the ram. I'm going to arm the... um. I probably should um, put the healing station in the back, but I'll keep it in the front just for people who want to stand here. But I'll probably do a double healing station because healing stations are OP. The healing stations really help us out. Okay, so this time you have four people instead of three because Ash Dude didn't disconnect this time, which is good. Ash Dude's a very good player, and I actually shot him out a lot. So this is Ash Dude. This is what he looks like. Yes. And then Diamond Fox I shot out a lot. And also DNA doesn't have a um doesn't have an Instagram or any social media to shout out. So I will put DNA's um ID in the description. I'll put Ash Dude's Instagram and I'll put Diamond Fox's YouTube channel. Yeah, all in the description. So they'll all have some sort of thing to find them. And yeah, so we're going to get Asha Dude up right now. So we can keep this raid going. And yeah, so I'm going to go run forward and kick out this missile station. Because this one and the cryo freezer are the two most annoying ones that they have. Remember, because we did a raid last night. And they had a level 6 version of this. And me and Diamond Foss had to sit here for like 5 minutes just to take it out. Which was really annoying. But yeah, we did. So I'm going to go up there and get um, Asha Dude, because he's going to die. And I'm down. Oh, no. Someone get Asha Dude. Someone get Asha Dude. I got Asha Dude. Okay. So we're all up. And we got to just heal the tank, and we should be able to go forward and win the raid again. So I'm going to try to play it more safe this time, because I want to make sure I'm alive at the end so I can show you the entire raid in case you're new to raids. So I can show you the entire thing. Like, last round, I unexpectedly died there. I didn't think I would. But yeah, the Cryo Freeze are also really annoying, so they're good to kill, but once we get far enough away from it, it won't really matter. Also, the Fort Guardian, the Pro, is one of the best ones, to be honest. It's one of the best ones you can get. I think it's like, I think the Pro is actually better than the Killer and the Legend. I'm not sure about that, but I think it's, it's not rated better, but I think it's better in my opinion. Also, if you guys would like me to um do my Call of Duty Mobile series back up or do a Minecraft series, tell me in the comments or our new Roblox series maybe. Because, you know, Pixel Gun, just doing straight Pixel Gun videos, it gets boring a bit. So if you guys want me to do a different series or want me to continue an old series I used to do, tell me in the comments. I'll be listening to subscribers and everything. And also, I was looking at my analytics and it says that 80% of you guys are not subscribed. So if you are here and you're not subscribed, or you thought you were and you're not, please subscribe. It really does help out, and it gives me more motivation to make these videos. Because the more, the more love I get, the more I want to make these videos, the more I want to entertain you guys. You know, I entertain you guys anyway, I hope. I hope my videos are entertaining. I really do. That's what I try to do. But from looking at this now, I think we have this raid in the bag. The only thing I'm worried about is um this guy, but he's dead. So yeah, so we're just going to use our heroic pays and um beat this gate. And repair the ramp. That's something important as well. So the gate should go down about now. Yep, let me go in. 
We gotta capture the flag. Kinda like in flag capture, except it's a lot longer. They, that's just what they need to do in slide capture. They need to add that. So that's the second round we won. And then I'm going to do one more round. And then I'm going to have to end the video there. So I can go do other things. But yeah, so that's the second round. Let's do one more. And then I'm going to sign off here. And also, if you guys are YouTubers who have videos. And you make content similar to mine. Tell me in the comments. Because I'll be happy to do a video with a fellow YouTuber or subscriber. I would be happy to. Because, you know, I like supporting other people in the same community as me. And I like them to come back and support me. So I like to make some friends in this community. Which I have made a few. Like, I made Diamond Fox. I got Asha Dude. I got DNA. So you see, you do make friends in this community very easily. But I would like to get a couple more because, um... Our clan is not doing so well at the moment. We're looking for active players. Like, we had 46 players, and only, like, five of us were active, and that's Fluffy and the officers. So we really, if you are active and you're looking for a clan, please come and join. Don't be sad if you get kicked. It was for a good reason. If you got kicked and you're watching this video, it was for the reasons you were probably not active and if you do join the clan from this video, don't get mad if you get kicked. Remember, it's for a good reason. It's because it's either because we have someone waiting for that position or it's because you just weren't active and you weren't helping the clan. Which, I mean, if that happens, don't blame us, to be honest. Like, we get people like, why'd you kick me? Why'd you kick me? And they never play, but they'll play when they're kicked, you know? And it's very annoying. Mm. Because, you know, we want to have active players. We don't want to have inactive players. We want our players mm -hmm. to play this game. Because we have one of our players who plays a lot of other games. And we don't kick him because he plays a lot of other games. He's in, like, a team or something. So we don't kick him because he has an excuse. So, like, say you something happened to you in your life and you just can't play at that time. That's understandable. But if you're not playing for just because you don't want to play, then just don't be in the clan then, to be honest. Don't. Yeah, here I'm going to distract the cryo for you just so that they can get by it. Because if they can't get by, then that means the raid will have to stop there. <laughs> and that wouldn't be too good because we would, we need to win this raid so we can get our points back up and maybe get to second or third place on the board. So we don't go down a rank because I'm planning on making a Crystal Division review once this season's over because I want the Crystal... The Crystal Division has not come out yet. I'm very sorry about that, guys, but the Crystal Vision has not come out yet. I have actually thought about making a Silver Division review, but we've been in the Silver Division so long ago that there's just no point in doing it, you know? Because we've already been there. I should have done it when I was just got into it, but yeah. So it looks like we're going to win this raid. It looks like that if he doesn't kill me here, because I know he's staring at me. But something that Pixel does need to fix is these turrets. Because if two people are standing next to it, it doesn't focus on one person. It focuses on like this. Do, 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 do. So it won't be able to hit you. This turret's good, though. Because once you get the target, it kills everything around it. But you know what I mean. It's like, they need to fix that. That's something that I think needs to be fixed. Because if not, it really does nerf the turrets. And you pay for these turrets with, like, all your gems. And you pay for the upgrades just for them to, um, not kill the people you want them to. But the fort guards are also really OP. I, in my opinion, they are because they're really strong. They have the same amount of health as a player. They use guns that a player would use. You know what I mean. It's like, they're, they're like, basically like players, except they don't play like players. That's the only thing is they'll stand there still like that. Where you can just snipe them. And nothing will happen. But yeah, so that's probably this is about to wrap up this raid. And also, I'm probably gonna do my outro right here. I hope you guys did enjoy this raid video. If you guys would like me to do more raid videos or maybe video my monster sieges, tell me in the comments or tell me by leaving a like and other things. So yeah, once this raid's done, I'm gonna wrap up the video in the end screen. Well, I'm going to thank all of you guys for watching. And I'm going to thank you guys all for not getting mad at me for not uploading in a bit. 
My name is I Raven signing out and I will see you all.